What's up everyone, it's Demolition Motion Derby for Life. I'm here gonna do another scrapping video. Uh, you're got, you guys are gonna be seeing quite a few of these. I recently just picked up this vehicle, literally today, and it's going to scrap in tomorrow. I picked this thing up for 300 bucks and decided to kind of give an idea if I would derby this or if I wouldn't derby it, in my opinion. So I got this guy, he's uh, starting to clean up his property and he's got a lot of junk vehicles. So I'm going to be picking up a bunch of his stuff whenever he's ready to get rid of it. So this one was is the very first one of many that I'm picking up. So you guys ready to see what I got? I picked up a 19, I think it's... Don't quote me on it. I don't know for sure the year, but I think it's an 80s, maybe, maybe early 90s. I I can't, I don't know for sure, but I think it's at least an 80s truck. So this guy, uh, he's cleaning up his property, and I happened to just roll on by and ask him, hey, you want to get rid of some of this stuff? And he said, sure, like we can kind of work out a deal. I paid 300 bucks for it, so I should be able to get my money back. It did have the catalytic converter still on it, so I'll make a little bit extra money, but I don't think they're worth very much. And I already cut the cat out of it, so that's not no big deal. Still got motor training, all the goodies, but this truck would be, I would not derby. Uh, it's kind of... I guess the word to say it's it, the frame looks like it's crap and the motor I think is junk tranny's junk but you could swap in your own own bit but the main reason why I would never derby a truck like this is because of the frame uh, body wise looks pretty decent uh, looks like you're you'll get your rot in the fenders and stuff and the floors do like the rot out here uh, from what I've seen from at work. But if you look up front, like it doesn't look too bad. The frame looks actually pretty decent. All right. Until you actually really look underneath. You got holes, big holes, probably two, three inches in diameter going all the way back, all the way through, all the way on both sides. So I think this is a very hard pass on derbying. Um, by all means, if someone else likes running these or just likes to have some fun, yeah, just go out, wreck, and you'll be done in about, eh, probably about two hits. Uh, because I believe as soon as this shifts or bends in any way, the drive shaft will just pull right out. Um, depending on how well it's in, and you got the transfer case and everything like that, and you'd have to disconnect the front drive shaft. Or you could leave it front wheel drive. But I think, yeah, you just pull that front shaft and then you leave the rear shaft in. And I, But I don't think this rear end would hold up very good. But, I mean, as you can see, that frame looks like absolute garbage. I don't think this would hold up very well at all. But there's one cat on this, so I don't know what it's worth. I figured probably anywhere from maybe 75, 100 bucks, maybe more. But I bought it for what it, I think it's about worth in scrap price. And, and yeah, uh, can't really open up the doors because they're wired shut. Eh, can't really peek in there. <laughs> Not really any goodies. Well, you can kind of see in the back. Uh, this guy did clean out this truck. Would be kind of a neat little thing to drive down the road. The box is actually in pretty good shape. It's not all rotted out. So maybe that would be something worth pulling. But I mean, over there in that corner, it's starting to rot right over here. But it's not all rotted out. Up in the corner here, it's starting to rot. I do have a truck that needs a box, but it's starting to rot up in here, and I don't, I, it's not really worth my time pulling it. 
I'd rather just get rid of it, see what it's worth in scrap. Can always get a different box and i plan on actually scrapping the truck that i want a box for so i got something different instead so we'll see but um i'm not sure on the rear end i think it's the rear ends are actually worth saving i think i'm not completely sure on that but i'm just gonna haul it in i'm not gonna fart around with it not really worth my time like i said but I don't think this would be a very good truck, the Derby. I think you'd get killed out there pretty quick. Maybe you would get lucky with a bone stock class. But this is a, what was it? It was a, a Ranger F-150. So, any goodies in there? Doesn't look like it. He, uh, it looked like he pretty well kind of went through everything and cleaned it all out so i don't think there's really anything worth saving he did pull the tailgate in the back bumper i'm not sure why but i guess he wanted to save it but yeah neat little truck but not something i'm gonna ever derby so i'm just gonna haul it in right away get my get my money back and and uh yeah but the next time you guys see this it'll be getting unloaded with the forklift or payloader or maybe playing the claw game but i know i think we're going to be saving parts out of here so i think that's going to be going to be something that's going to happen but thank you guys for watching my videos i appreciate it hope you guys enjoyed this little video uh don't forget to like and subscribe Catch you guys all in the next video.